choose the WW directory. One warning, if your WAM survey don't start, it means uh, uh, there is a conflict with Skype, possibly, or some other program like XAMPP. So please uh, stop the other programs running in the background before you start uh, WAM server. So in, w, in we find we open the WW folder, which is placed on our local C drive where we installed WAM server in WAM directory, and the WWW folder contains our our website we are going to use uh, for uh, for programming on our Windows operating uh, computer. So the index PHP uh, is, uh, is just PHP file which has some contents. What we can do now, we will create our own file. We can choose new, right click of the right click, right, right button, right mouse button clicks, folder. We can name it users, double click on it. So it's empty now. We can write the file, but we can also copy this file. Control C. Control paste and with right click we can open with WordPad and modify it. So each file has uh, starts with pH uh, with with this few characters and ends with uh, this few characters. For our example, we will remove the content now which was in our previous index PHP file. So we have only this part which is necessary to run PHP files. And instead of the previous content, we will create use a comment echo, which display words contained in the uh, let's say new users. We can save it to our users folder and now we go and start these files in our browser so again click on the one icon in the right bottom corner click localhost your browser which was configured opens up and this is where is our www directory is but we create another folder which was users slash index php in this in this file let's say let's check if and correct it if it's possible oh sorry instead of echo we put e echo that's uh, echo new users. So now we save it, and uh, we can refresh it. F five, and what you will see on the left is the word we put put into echo new users, and that's how we create uh, index PHP or PHP files with a basic echo comment.